Hey guys, it's General Heat here. How's everyone doing? Uh, today, we're going to be tackling the game Wolfenstein 2 again, but this time we're going to be tackling the question of whether you can get away with killing Hitler. So, a little spoiler here, but um, towards the end of the game Wolfenstein, maybe like around 75% of the way through, 80% of the way through, you're supposed to travel to uh, the planet Venus, because that is where Hitler and most of the Nazi High Command are hiding out. And... What you're doing here at first during this scene is you're actually undercover and auditioning for a movie. You're, aud you're actually auditioning for the role of yourself for uh, a propaganda film that Hitler wants to make about uh, the main character of this game, Blaskovitz. And as you can see here, Hitler is kind of like a senile old man. He's just like pretty, he just acts all ridiculous and crazy. But he, he um... During this scene, it's a long cutscene, but after the cutscene, you're supposed to like memorize the lines. You gotta impress Hitler and make him believe you actually are an actor. Otherwise, if you don't, well, he's gonna shoot you, and he en he ends up shooting quite a few actors. But after this scene, you do have a chance to kill Hitler, and that happens at this very brief moment here, where um, after he shoots one of the last actors that uh, failed to meet his standards. You're asked to audition next for uh, one of the uh, fight scenes. And it is during this part, uh, instead of walking into the box to continue your audition, if you walk up to Hitler, you see you have an option here to attack him. Uh, in my case, it says hold right stick, depending on what platform you're on. You have a button you can press to kill Hitler. And there's actually an achievement for it, too. So. That is definitely something you do, but unfortunately, the minute you kill him, uh, everyone in the room turns against you and starts shooting you, and you pretty much uh, die really quickly because there's like a giant robot in the room plus a lot of um, high-level soldiers. <clears throat> so, yeah, uh, you're pretty much doomed if you kill him, but that's what checkpoints are for, and it's pretty much just for getting an achievement. Now, for a while, I've been trying to find a way to survive to get away with killing Hitler, see if it's even possible. And I found out that you could survive for a little bit longer by hiding behind um, this uh, lady here, and she'll pretty much absorb most of the most of the uh, bullets for you. But eventually the guards do get around her and shoot you. But for quite a while, she's like a bullet sponge for you. But unfortunately, you still die. So, with that, I turn to the PC version of Wolfenstein 2. And there's a mod tool, also known as a trainer, that gives me uh, the ability to have infinite health and infinite armor. Basically god mode. And this trainer can only be used on the PC of course, so that's why I had to use the PC version for this. But as you can see here, uh, this is just uh, an example as proof that the trainer works. You can see my health is at 999 and my armor is at 998. And no matter how many shots I take, I don't lose any health. And my weapon is infinite ammo and bottomless clip as well. So that's proof here that the trainer works. And pardon the frame rate and uh, the graphics on my PC version. I this particular PC doesn't have a great graphics card. It's it's the top of the line Intel graphics and get the Iris Pro 580, I believe, to be exact. But despite how impressive it is for an Intel graphics card, it's still a uh, little lacking. But it should be sufficient. Anyways, here we are on this mission again with the trainer working. See my health and armor. Let's see what happens now. And well. Looks like I still died, but let's try again. Uh, I I did double check at this part to make sure the trainer was definitely on, and it is on. Uh, so let's kill Hitler again. And unfortunately, it seems like um, it seems like even with God mode enabled, you still die on this mission. Basically, I think. It's it's not that you're scripted to die like right away. It, it's more like the uh, the shots the enemies take at you are instant kill no matter what. And I guess in this case, instant kill overrides infinite health. So yeah, so the best you can do to survive longer is pretty much hide behind uh, this girl here and use her as a bullet sponge. Yeah, I I guess we can make a challenge out to see to see who can survive the longest uh, on this mission. <laughs> But I'm pretty sure you can't survive for very long. But if someone figures out how to survive longer, you know, let me know. I'd definitely be very interested. Now, just a little fun side thing here, a little glitch I found. 
if you hide behind that girl, sometimes, I think it's only on a PC version, but sometimes, uh, if you hide behind her for long enough, uh, Hitler just stands up again. <laughs> like, he's he just comes back to life somehow. <laughs> he's been, like, resurrected. It's, it's kind of weird. <laughs> but, yeah, there you have it. And that only happened twice for me, but I've, I've managed to reproduce it just once. But, yeah, so, there you have it, guys. That should answer that question. And the answer is no, you cannot get away with killing Hitler, as far as I know. If anyone knows, like, a better mod or trainer out there for Wolfenstein 2, um, feel free to recommend it to me in the comments, and I can give this a try again. Uh, maybe there's something else better there that can help me survive, but... I don't know, we'll see. For now, I'm going to say the answer is no. It is not possible to get away with killing Hitler. Anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. And as always, make sure to leave a like if you did. And, you know, just uh, like I said, we're expanding. And we're still doing Halo content, of course. Don't worry. But we're also expanding. So if there's any other games or any other thing you want me to check out, it doesn't have to be Halo. It could be anything. Just let me know in the comments. And um, I'll, you know, take a look at it. I'll do my best. But other than that, uh, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe and stay tuned, and I will see you guys next time.